You think the Texans are a better football team now than they were when the season ended? Like we took, if we look at it. Obviously, that's almost not fair. Let's look at it. The healthiest part of the Texans, you know, when they've got Tank and they got, you know, uh, uh, Nico healthy and everything. You think that right now? Like I do. You think that I think they're a better team right now than they were last year, even at the healthiest point. The team that did what they did. I think they're better. Do you think they're better right no. now? No, the Texans. You don't think the Texans are no. really? With the additions they've made defensively, Hunter, I know they've they've had some losses, but you don't think overall they're better at running back? No. I think they improved I mean, over you, Blake. You had, you had a double digit sack pass rusher when the season ended. You had you had a linebacker that was covering folks vertical in the past game and was getting and was and was capable of getting 19, 20 tackles in a game. Um you had a, a number two corner that was dependable. Um no, nah, I mean, I, I don't know. I, I think, I think now again, I, I'm going to continue to lean into this. I think the Texans are incomplete. But but right now, if, if the season started right now, they do not have a starting defensive tackle. We we can we can get into this given the situation right now when D'Amico I'll talks. I'll give you that. Yeah, give and you. When D'Amico talks and Nick talks, they're going to tell you about how many snaps this guy had and how versatile this guy is and how many starts this guy is. That that's you have to do those things when like I, I guarantee you they ain't they ain't gotta tell us how many how many snaps Daniel uh, Daniel Hunter had. I bet you they ain't telling us how many how many how many games he started in the last two years. No, because you know he's a game changer. I mean he's he's a he's a, a legitimate take your take your defense to the next level, take your organization to the next level sign. I mean that's that's who he is. Um the only reason we're hearing those things from Nick, and I'm sure we'll hear it from D'Amico as well, is because those guys they know as good as well as we do. They ain't got a starting defensive tackle in, in the in the in the room over there. 